Here's from SNY.TV. Latest on Mets top prospects, Jeremiah Jackson. That's double A regular season on high now. Now, if you like videos on the Mets prospect and their minor leagues, you need to subscribe to the Prospect Talk. I'll get every little tidbit, every information about the Mets and these young players that they brought in from all these trades and, and of course, all the players they draft and whoever else comes into the organization. Here we go. This is about Jeremiah Jackson. A Jeremiah Jackson acquired in the Dominic Leone trade finished the double A regular season with a strong performance in Binghamton's 3 2 win on Sunday afternoon. The infielder went 3 for 4 with an RBI and two stolen bases. Jackson is hitting 311 over his last 20 games and he records seven homers, six stolen bases, 24 RBIs, and an OPS of 801 since being acquired ahead of the deadline. He was acquired for Dominic Leone from the Angels. Here's Jeremiah Jackson's uh, scouting report, and this is from MLB.com. He's the 22nd best prospect in the Mets organization. He was selected 50, 57th overall in the, in the 2018 MLB draft in the second round. The Angels' second round pick in the 2018 draft, Jackson is a product of the Alabama high school ranks, who was teased with his offensive potential. Currently, he's 23 years old. He'll be 24 going into next season. Particularly his power since signing. He set the bar high when his, 20, when his 23 homers established a Pioneer League record in 2019, with injuries and inconsistencies slowing him down, slowing him more since. He missed a good chunk of time in 21, his full season debut with a quad injury, and then an oblique strain forced him out for a month and a half in 2022. The Angels didn't protect him on the 40-man roster, and he wasn't selected in the Rule 5 draft. He was back to being healthy and was a league average bat with double-A Rocket City in 23 before he was traded to the Mets at the deadline for Dominic Leone. Jackson still has the loud, raw tools that made him a second-round pick. He's kept off leaving the yard in any plate appearance. Ball jumps off his bat, and even with the time missed and some issues with his overall approach, he still hit 24 homers. And 136 combined games in 21 and 22. He has wiry strength with bat speed and loft, with the power especially to his pull side. He did cut down in strikeouts in 22, but his ability to make consistent hard contact still has not shown up. Now, I would mention he was drafted by Mets' current uh, general manager, Billy Epler, when he was with the Angels, when he was their general manager there. A good athlete who runs well and has a good arm, Jackson was a shortstop when he first signed, but has had more positions added to his repertoire. Playing a lot of second base, but also learning third and even playing some left field in 2022. He continued to move around this season with time at third, second, short, center field, and left field. And it's all done to get his bat in the lineup, but now in his age 23 season, it's time to turn that power potential into an everyday strength. Now I'm going to go through a little bit of his numbers so I can have an idea. And then meanwhile, please, of course... Uh, you need to subscribe to the prospect. You'll learn every little tidbit about all these prospects the Mets have in their farm system. So over the season, he hit 252, went on base percentage of 328, slugging percentage of 450, 778 sl uh, OPS over the whole season with two, two leagues. He was 801 with the Mets. Uh, he hit 22 homers, 80 RBIs. That's very strong for double A. And he had 27 stolen bases. So if you like to listen to videos about the Met prospects, the Mets minor leaguers, this is the channel you need to subscribe to. Can't emphasize that enough. You'll be the first one to know about all these prospects that the Mets have in their farm system of all your Mets fan friends that you have. And if you have friends, send them a link to the channel and hopefully subscribe. And let me know what you think about this video. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you later.